Okay, everyone, we're back, and we are playing Then There Was Chaos, scenario 8 of episode 2 of After the Storm. And we are in a position where we've defeated the main bulk of the army attacking us, and all we have left to do is get rid of troops who are in guard position and the leaders themselves, and a few stragglers who are kind of wandering around aimlessly. So let's get to it. Okay, uh, I was hoping that this spectre could reach that house in a single turn. Hmm, no, no such luck. Now this turn, all I want to try and do is lure out Malregath from his house. And I ought to be able to do that by... I. Uh, the unit I want to do the luring is not available. Not fast enough. Well, maybe if I come down here, I can. Uh, I can still lure. Let's try it. The uh, war drone can't make it. Not this turn. Well, the lich can. I've got this elf on a tree over here. As ever, Durban is slow. Can happily use this sprite, and the sprite will gain a level. Alright, that wasn't very effective, but it didn't need to be. Oh, you're fast. Wow. Okay. Less than impressive showing. Okay, down you go. And then next turn, you guys should be able to reach the Lich if he comes out of his house. Yelena, you go there. Anya, you're looking very beaten up. Okay, so everyone... Get ready to fight. Okay, the uh, Ancient Lich does not come out, so... <laughs> the mountain will have to go to Muhammad. So I think then I'll try and summon out this war drone first. So if I go here with someone, that ought to work. If we 
can get Anya nearer to a level, and she doesn't need to heal up to full health anymore. Oh, these guys are so annoying. Just keep going. Oh no! How useless can you be? Ugh! Okay, who should I use to do the luring? Probably, still, this bone shooter. Okay, that's something. Now who to put here? I might lose my dryad if I put her there. Could put Elinia there. And in fact, I think I will. Then you can go there. Really? Range attack a spectre? Okay. And here comes... Okay, you can die with honor. You did a great deal of damage. And, even better, you freed up some of my income, which is just perfect. So, as the morning dawns... I'm glad Durban picked up that amulet that gives him bonus range resistance. Still. Whew. You know, you are allowed to miss on occasion too. That is a thing. Missing is a thing. Ah. Okay, you didn't miss, that's good. Over here... You do what you want, to be honest. Uh, that's for you. Don't think. Yeah, you can't be one shotted. No! Don't want you to do that. So I'm just going to plonk you down here in front of Anya. And then again, if the Lich wants to come out, is welcome to try. Might well come out and kill my Dryad, which would be a shame. Because that is my most experienced unit, has already had an after maximum level advancement. Hopefully, if, if he does do that, I'll at least get some burn damage in first. Oh, I've uh, triggered Horsey McHorseface down here. How many hits do you have? 
Oh, four blade attacks. All right, fine. Okay, but the Lich does not come out to play, and that is good news. Especially since it's daytime now. Alright, finish you off. Don't really want you... Um, how far can this guy reach? Okay, not too far. This guy not too far. Good, good. Durvin to do is slow without dying and I think he should be able to do with that. The only concern is then I need to kill the Lich this turn so that he doesn't die next turn. Good start. So there I took all the damage it was possible to take, and actually only dealt 20 out of 6 attacks. Pretty weak. Okay, Anya can't die from this either. Quite like her to get the level. What about my Fire Fairy? You can't die from this. Man, it's going to take a while to heal from this nonsense. Alright, that's a good chunk of experience for Anya, who's now... What am I going to go for? Chill damage plus one, Day's weapon special. That's pretty cool, Day's is, Day's is handy. Um, yeah, I think that's good. So days, when hit with this attack, an enemy suffers a 10% penalty both to their defense and chance to hit for one turn. Other specials that take effect chance to hit take precedence over this special. Magical attacks will still have a 70% chance to hit. Marksman attacks are only effective if the chance to hit is greater than 60%. Okay, so... Handy though, handy. Let's get you into a zone of control situation so you can't pop out and be an asshole. Maybe even kill you. I wish I had enough gold to hire a bat. That's what I really need at this point. Well, we can sort out the health later on. The loyal horse dude is dead. And this drone should be aggroed, but only by Anya. Is there anything in this temple? That will be interesting to find out. Should I, though, first... How much damage do you do? Not much. How much damage can you take? Well, you're weak to arcane. Um, I could let you be attacked by this horseman. If this horseman really wants to attack you... You won't die. Yeah, so I'll put you here. Um, oh no, that will mean that you get attacked by the drone. I won't do that, I'll put you over here. Okay, that's nothing special, it's just a temple a village with normal temple graphics. Okay. It's going to take me a while to heal up from this bullshit. Look, I've got plenty of turns. Okay, wasn't expecting that. Just annoying, really. There we go. 
Oh, Anya, you can be poisoned. Interesting. Weak, very weak. That's better. Everyone's doing quite badly as regards damage at the moment. And Anya, you're not in a position to do very well either. If you get the kill, will you level up? Yes, you will. Okay, good. I should aim for that. Fifteen. Okay, that didn't go as planned. I'm gonna plonk you. Uh, no. Undo. There. You go and get that house over there. And now my income's looking pretty decent, so maybe I can afford that bat. All right, let's uh, get some health back, and then we can discuss our next move. You're doing good, so you can come down here and find this demon. Very nice. Can allow a linear to get the kill when she's closer to a level. Ugh. And who can reach over here to this guy? The Spectre can, and my Fire Fairy can. My Fire Fairy very easily get killed, unfortunately. But Elinia can too. Um, sorry, not Elinia. Anya, who's a different person. Oh man, my damage this battle, especially this turn, has been nothing short of atrocious. Can the Spectre do the kill? Yes, if it's lucky. Right, now you're very close to a level. Oops, no, don't want to do that. I'm going to put you there. You there. And I'm not in any danger if I move you over to here. Then I can also move you to there. And you to here. And we're good. There's two more blue villages down there. Again, would like to send a bat down to grab them, but don't have the income yet. A few more turns, maybe. Okay, my enemies such as they are, are recruiting absolute junk and sending it my way.
Unbelievable. I was wondering whether that might happen. <laughs> the Spectre manages to miss with every single one of his attacks and is therefore in danger of death, which is not a usual situation for Spectres to be in. I can let Elinia try and get this kill. And then someone else will have to then move in. Not scared of you. Uh, you stay where you are, you stay where you are. You're quite fast too, so... Not as fast as these guys. You can just come down here with a linear. Alright. Keep forgetting that slowing is only on the defensive. Shame that. Oh no. no! What I really don't want is for you to go and capture all my villages. <sighs> I should probably go and take out this purple leader. Two more turns and I can get that bat I wanted. And we'll see if the... Uh, if this leader... Oh, he's got... He's, he's the extra beefed up type of Chaos Lawkeeper who randomly has extra ethereal blast attacks. That's good to know. Where is my luck? Okay, this Spectre has just missed 8 attacks on 50%. And the only way I can actually do anything about that... I mean, I could leave you where you are. Um, it's probably the smartest move. And this poor Spectre is just going to have to deal. Anya can reach the rest of my troops quite easily, so she can chase down this guy or try to we'll see what he's going to do. If he goes up there, that would be irritating, but I can always come out and zap him if he does. Okay, Green's troop runs away. This guy's not going for the smartest of life choices. Now this guy can come in and do damage. Trouble is, if he does, he might get killed next turn. So how to square that circle? Well, I think... How much range damage will you take? Okay, only the Infernal Chill. Nine five it, it, Ethereal Blast. That's not actually that powerful an attack. It's less powerful than... Well, it, no, it, it's substantially more powerful than what these guys have got, unfortunately. Okay, let's just do it. Okay, Alinea is one experience away from a level.
Are there any drones? No, nothing that can reach me immediately. So I'll just get in position to be maximally irritating. You can't reach, you can't reach, you can't reach. But if I range attack you, you'll be able to do 50 damage to me. So probably best leave the spectre out of there for now. So you're almost dead. I could just go in there and try my luck. Seems like you'd be a dumbass even if I hit you once to then attack me next turn. Still not worth the risk. I'm not worth the risk of leaving you within range of this guy either. I just put you in a position where it can't, Elinia can't heal you, and if you go there, you could get zapped. So. Just hop back onto this house, or rather, just come down here for now. Next turn, you'll be all healed up. Good. First after maximum level advancement for this spectre, and now I can choose who gets the experience more or less from uh, from this guy. And if I can land a linear on the uh, on the target square, then that would be brilliant. Because then she, first of all, Rodola the druid, the dryad. guy off and then you just need one hit protect the lady of light ah, ah. Oh. now I just need to deal with you okay get on it Ilinia you pick yourself a bat and can go and grab those villages. And I can even start aggroing these units. Particularly if I go down here, I can aggro the Enforcer Drone during the day without aggroing. Yes. Okay. You know, reach, you know, reach, you reach. Excellent. Now I need to stop this guy. Shame this village isn't one of mine yet. You're quite close to a level. That's cool. Ah! Perfect. Fantastic work. Now that you've done that, Alinea, you can hop down to here, and you can go here in case it's this forest spirit that gets attacked. Not taking it all too quickly, but uh, that's not really a problem. Comes drone, but drone face. 
takes quite a lot of damage on the rebound. The bat can start by going down here. Do need to be careful that if I move out here I will start to aggro the other units. I don't suppose the Lady of Light is going to come out of her base. now can choose her upgrade. Amazingly, this gives focus four gives ensnare another damage and also stun. Um, and since I do use that a lot, I think it's worth having. Still no thorns, thorns is useless, still no plus ten percent arcane resistance. That's not mostly not that useful. Um, and when I do need to do damage, I can just tank it with my enormous number of hit points. So yeah, focus. And then the kill can be had by... Uh, by Anya. Alright, that should be enough to aggro this Marshal. And there's not much else left on the map now. Anyone I put here can get attacked by both the Lady of Light and the Marshal in principle, so I don't really want to expose my dru my dryad to that. So instead, I'm going to just going to put her here. Put you here. Put you down here. And what about you? You can come and get ready to join in the fight. You could now choose your opponent, Anya or Helenia. Oh, you silly loyal fool. good amounts of healing. You can go and grab these houses. How far can you reach? You can reach to this house. So I probably shouldn't go there just yet. But I can go around into these woods and attack this guy. And Alinea, fortunately, is on full health just before she has to face the fake Lady of Light. work. Should I, should I just aggro you anyway? Probably not the end of the world, especially if you don't come out of your port. I do need that nice, sweet income. Oh, 
Only one of you can reach my fire fairy. Good stuff. kill Anya for some reason, and, interestingly, this drone didn't get aggroed after all. Or at least it's shitting itself too much to be concerned. Here goes our next turn. Now what's the actual objective here? Eleni must defeat the False Lady of Light by herself. Okay, that's pretty unambiguous. No scope for interpretation. So I can use someone fairly tough to do the zone of controlling. In fact, we're going to have to because there are some level 3 units here. Maybe I should actually wait one more turn. So you're not in range, you are, so hopefully you will come out. You stay where you are, you also should probably stay where you are, and you just come up behind here, and good. Purple player thinks he's going to be sneaky and send a drone up here. Well, I know your game. Hmm. Knowing is half the battle. Crucially, only half. So the False Lady of Light has to not be killed by any other unit. So let's just save the game, because what I want to know is if damage by other units counts as killing. More specifically, whether I can use Durban to slow. Right, well it's possible. And now, now that it's possible, it has to be done, <laughs> because Durban will die if I don't. Ah, oh, brilliant. So, you come around, it's night time, you should do a decent amount of damage. Perfect. Now that you've been slowed, you shouldn't be... Alright, Anya's not uh, had her Weetabix today, clearly.
You're flipping cursed. You're supposed to have 70% chance to hit. Maybe now the uh, randomized magic is hit kicking in. Alright, you're already slowed, so there's no point doing that. And I can't kill you this turn. I shall never be defeated by vile imposters like you. Do you truly believe your own lies? Why don't you show these elves what you are capable of? Your great powers as the Lady of Light. Who are you? And why are you posing as me? Your end is at hand. I shall not answer. Gods, kill her! Back, you fools! What is this? She emanates such a radiant light! What? What are we doing? Do not hesitate! Kill her! No! Who... Who should we trust? My lady! Elenia, the Lady of Light, I remember you. No! We have been deceived. No! What have we done? This is not over yet. The False Lady of Light has escaped. We still need to defeat the other commanders. Alright, defeat all remaining enemy leaders. That, though, now that you've become my unit, is not so much of an issue. And interestingly, I'm glad, actually, I was, you know, if, if you'd come in and got killed, then, well, that would be it. You'd be dead. But you didn't. So I can grab some of these villages, and, yeah... Don't need to worry about anything much else now. Fantastic to have a druid. So you go there. You go there. And you just sit in the middle and do your druid magic. And you have done your job for this scenario. Because now all villages other than these top one, this top one here and these two, are in the bag. Okay, the drone comes back. Now this is an imp with Drain and Poison, which means that people who are immune to Drain and Poison, such as Forest Spirits, are the best ones to use. Spectres also. Speaking of which... Good, good. Alright, let's just go for it. Forest spirits are doing just grand. Get another village. You come up here just in case. Alright, if I were this in, um, my trousers would be pretty brown right now, I think. Not a problem. You've got a lot of health. 
Hopefully I can slow you with a linear. And you didn't even poison me. Fantastic. Alright, now it's time for the big guns. damage okay you're on 31 now one more dose I think of all right now you're on 15 health and that's enough for Anya to one-shot you. That fiend retreated into the Shockstall Hive. Her crimes against the unity of the Elvish civilization must not go unpunished. I shall pursue her underground if need be. My lady, we cannot let you go underground alone. It's become an increasingly dangerous place since the new hive was completed. We haven't seen him or her ourselves yet, but the humans have been spreading rumours of the arrival of a powerful ally of the Imposter. They might be awaiting you. My lady, I... I mean Alunia, let us go with you, please. If there's anything else we can do to try to amend our great mistake, let's go together. Sweet. 184 bonus gold for the next scenario. And let's look at our achievements. So in terms of losses, we lost a bone shooter. Um, I think these level 2 undead are pretty expendable, to be honest. Um, a sprite, which is a shame. Um, also some skeletons, vampire bat. Um, yep, nothing too terrifying. In advancements, we got the bone shooter, of course. We got a forest spirit. We got a fire fairy. Um, so... On the whole, we're doing pretty well. Um, I did take quite a lot of damage that I didn't need to take overall there, and especially in that second half of the battle. Um, but uh, it could have been worse. Could have been a lot worse. And uh, financially, I am doing just grand. So I'm going to leave it there for today. Thanks, everyone, for tuning in. And see me next time. See you, see me, see each other next time.